women ain't shit. I just, someone said some, some women. The women that be y'all ain't shit. I just want to put it out there. And I'm gonna need y'all not to judge me for the hell. What the hell I'm about to tell y'all? Cool. Heffles. And if you know me, any story about any club I may have went to after I turned 25, it's going to include the light. Now, if you don't know what the fuck the light is by now, I'm sorry. This is my last time telling you. It's a club in the south part of Richmond. It costs $5. Got good chicken. Got big women. We good? So, I'm in the, I'm in the goddamn light. Now, a couple years ago, I didn't have a spot to stay at. I always stayed in hotels on Melody. Them shit was like $30. Minus the bed bugs and the crackheads outside and the hookers, man. You can't be $30 plus plus tax. <laughs> fuck y'all. My homeboy scooped me up that goddamn, uh, what was that, that Saturday. Went to the liquor store, came back to the hotel, got drunk. I mean, man, I was fucked up. Like, I'm in that motherfucker, like, what's up? So I already know, my plan for that night is to get some cheeks. I don't give a fuck if she was ugly, cute, super ugly. I don't give a fuck what she looked like. As long as she was a girl, I was trying to fuck. I'm sorry, that's what happened when I was drunk. You go in the light, you liable to see out of ten girls, six of them was cute. The other four, you got two eye and two is like, bitch, you should have stayed at home. Like, I'm telling you, out of ten girls in the light, six cute, two is eye, the other two like, motherfucker, you 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 may not you may want to put a mask on. But which one do you think I went for? All ten of them, motherfucker. I don't give a fuck what they was talking about. So I looked up on the eye one. I'm like, cool. She gave me her number and everything. But she won't try to fuck. She's like, um, I be seeing you online, Mr. Funny, but um, I'm not fucking. Damn. Oh, you don't want to talk to me now? Hey, no, 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 man. I, I, I talk to you. I text you. Whatever. Cool. Give me a number. All right. Everything is everything. But as the night go on, I'm assuming she done got some liquor in her. Because she done came up behind me and whispered. She like, I love me a fat boy. I'm like, man, what the heck? She like, hey, big boy. I said, first of all, bitch, just because I got your number, you're not going up, up here and insult me. I know I'm fat. Then she smacked my ass and my tank tighten up. Bitch, did you just smack my ass? Man, you get the fuck away from me, though, if I hear, if I hear but your goddamn ass. So, me and her just started joking, like, oh, man, she cool as shit. We had a nice little vibe going on. I even offered to buy her some uh, drink and some chicken. Shit, you know, I don't like to spend my money, but, what, $9 for some chicken? About $7 for a drink or something? She was good. Text her ass and made like, hey, baby, let me know when you make it back to the spot. You know what I'm saying? Trying to show I can shit, because she not going to fuck if she don't think I can. Hey, <laughs> shit. Of course, my drunk ass passed out as soon as I got to the house. So I ain't as soon as I got back to the hotel. So I ain't really give a fuck. I woke up in the morning, text, "Hey, beautiful," you know what I'm saying? When they, "Hey, beautiful," she said, "Hey, handsome fat boy, bitch, stop calling me fat boy. Like I don't want to be reminded that I'm fat." So she's like, "What you doing?" I said, "I ain't shit laying here chilling." She's like, "What you doing?" She, I like, I asked her what she was doing. She's like, "Nothing over here, naked." First of all, don't tell me you naked, cause I'm, I'm like, "Can I pull up?" No, my kids is here. They in the other room. <laughs> so she like, I'm about to video chat you. You probably around one of your hoes. No, no, no. Hey, you good? Boom. She video chat me. First thing I see when she video chat me on Facebook, nipple. Oh, uh, hey, you got your titties out. She like, I told you I was naked. Oh, I didn't know this was that type of party. I didn't know. I didn't get dressed for the occasion, nigga. I still got on my clothes from last night. <laughs> I still smell like Ciroc, bitch. <laughs> so she like, whatever, boy. So we just joking. She was like, what you over there doing? I like, man, I told her I was laying down. She like, oh, I ain't doing nothing. She just grabbed it on the titty and shit. In the process, I'm still hung up, but my dick is like, nigga, is that a titty I see? I'm like, bro, stop. So in the process, she keep fucking grabbing the titty, then she keeps showing the whole body and shit. I'm like, bitch, you look, I ain't naked, bitch. I might, I might nut in you. keep playing. Okay, pause for a second. Me, I told y'all I was staying in the hotel. So normally I get this shit for a couple days, then I come back. So I swore I paid for Monday, but I end up paying just till Sunday. So I had to check out Sunday at 11. Man, meanwhile, man, this bitch is on the phone 10 30, 10 45. So I know she keep playing with these titties now. I'm just going to beat this dick. You know what I'm, I'm going to get this nut off real quick. But I'm not going to show her that because that bitch may screenshot me and put me on the internet. Like, I don't need my little dick floating all over fucking Facebook. So I'm just trying to keep a straight face and looking at her play with them titties and shit. I'm like, yeah. Are you gonna keep playing? Hey, lick that nipple for me. Uh, hey, let me call you back, bro. I couldn't focus. Man, I put the phone down. In the middle of me fucking about to get my shit all here to something. Housekeeping. I'm like, man, hold on. But I guess she didn't hear me. Fucking Chinese lady gonna walk in, nigga. I'm like, oh my. I said, mm. She said, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm like, oh, fuck, man. Oh, shit. That nut felt good as a motherfucker. 
And make sure y'all share. Make sure y'all share this video and come to our comedy show on Father's Day at the Funny Bone, June 16th. Get your tickets now. Hey.